I just signed up for two free months of Skillshare.com, courtesy of one of my favorite YouTubers, Mark Bone. I was one of the first thousand people to click on a link in one of his most recent video descriptions for a two free month sign up of Skillshare. By the way, Skillshare is not sponsoring this video. The point of this video is to point out the fact that I am a uh, filmmaker, I'm a professional videographer, I do it full time for a living. But the crazy thing is I never went to film school. I've only been doing this at my current level for about a year. As of right now, other than the YouTube videos that I've watched, I have no formal, you know, paid for education in video production. Everything that I've learned up to this point, I have learned through YouTube literally just Googling different techniques, watching YouTube videos about certain things, picking up on things here and there from experience. Today, I'm just coming forward to say that I'm finally making the decision to invest a little more in the education part of it um, because I'm so passionate about it and I wanna continually learn and grow and get better. And I think one of the ways to do that is to not just gain experience, but invest in learning and education. I'm gonna dive into some courses here and keep you guys posted on how it goes. Um, I'm really curious to see what the difference is between learning on a platform like Skillshare, where traditionally you pay, you subscribe in order to learn and watch their videos, versus YouTube, which is a free public platform. Anybody can upload anything they want, and whether it's a reliable source of learning or not um, you really have to dig and find those like nuggets of wisdom and those nuggets of knowledge that you would normally have to go to school for but on Skillshare this is my first experience with it I'm gonna see if there's actually a lot of like really valuable knowledge that you can find for just eight dollars a month I think is what it is normally we're gonna see through that if Skillshare is worth it if I learn anything more valuable on Skillshare than I have on YouTube, you know, if if paying just that little bit extra money to subscribe to Skillshare is worth it to learn that little bit extra more than you wouldn't learn on YouTube. And we're just gonna test it out, see how it goes, and I will keep you posted. So let's get into it. Every YouTuber says that. So let's go learn some skills that people have shared with us. Coffee kind of primes the brain for uh, for learning. We're good to go. guys I just finished my first online course with Skillshare um, it was a 40 minute course on DIY like do-it-yourself cinematography um, I sat down and did it all in one setting and um, it was really interesting it was one of the top rated ones when I searched under filmmaking and cinematography it popped up with a lot of reviews a lot of people had taken it so far I think Skillshare is looking pretty cool and already you know I'm just one course into it and the value and the knowledge that I've gained just from one course I think is more than you know a ton of different YouTube videos that I would watch and so so far thumbs up like I said I'm excited to dive more into it diving into more of these courses and taking as many notes as I can on that note I'll catch you on the flippity flip. Office reference. <laughs>